We've got a lot of hostiles inside, agents. They're holding Dr. Candle and her staff. We need those personnel back at the base so we can get the medical wing functional. We'll hold here to cover your back. Then we'll escort the medical personnel when you retrieve them. me into the security system, I might be able to find Candle's location. Hatched in. Let's see what I can find. Can you see the CCTV feed? Looks like Candle and her staff are being forced to treat their wounded. That's the only reason they're still alive. It looks like they've got people upstairs, in a restaurant. There's a lot of these guys, but if you use cover, you should be able to pick them off without making yourself a target. Additional styles detected. Additional hostiles detected. Morning. Additional hostiles detected. Candle and her staff are still upstairs, stashed in the kitchen at Kobe's. Word is that they've really trashed the place. It would have broken my dad's heart to see it go to hell like this. We used to watch games there together. Now entering a safe area. I think it's better my folks didn't live to see any of this. But then I think about all the people doing their best to keep going. That's who we do this for, Agent. Go get them. To get to Kobe's, you'll have to pass by some contaminated areas. There used to be plenty of sick people being treated there before they got shot. So be careful. Warning. We're exiting the safe area. Warning. You are now leaving the safe area. The escort party's taking heavy fire from the roof. They can't move until you get up there and take down that gunner. We're pinned down! There's no way we'll make it across alive unless someone can get up there and take out the big guns! All yours, Agent.
warning. Additional hostiles incoming. safely across. Candle and all staff accounted for. No casualties. We're off to a good start, agents. Wish I could have had your back out there, but I think we make a hell of a team anyway. When you get back to the base, we'll talk to Candle and we'll see what she can do for us. my prayers. I'm telling you, you're lucky you don't gotta work with these Sarah types. I hear they're a real bunch of... Well, look who it is! Thanks for getting me out of the garden. I've been in some hostile work environments before, but Jesus! Of course, it's not like this place is gonna win any prizes either. Antique equipment, zero staff, patients lining up out the door. This isn't gonna cut it. We're doing the best we can, Dr. Candle. Any suggestions you might have, I'm happy to listen. I know, I know. Beggars, choosers, all that crap. What matters is beating this thing, but I can't do that without knowing more about it. And here's a good place to start. Sarah is pretty sure Dr. Gordon Amherst had something to do with the outbreak. God. That asshole. Saw him present a paper at Columbia once, he nearly started a riot. He's part of this? I need to talk to him. Anything of his you can find. Notebooks, laptops, close personal friends, I need that too. And we need to talk about live samples and antibodies. You're gonna be busy. And you'll be? Fixing this. Saving lives. Now if you'll excuse me, I'll get started. Looks perfect. I can't thank you enough. But I will bring you something from my wine rack. That's what I call an improvement agent. You should charge more.
finally, a clinic. Gotta start somewhere. We've got enough staff to start tending to the public, but we've got our work cut out for us. This is perfect, Agent. These decontamination facilities are going to save lives and stop the spread of disease. Quarantine. We needed this pretty badly. Now we can properly isolate the sick and exposed, keeping the rest of us safer. Yes! I got my virus lab. Finally enough equipment and staff to do proper analysis. Thank you, Agent.